Well, hello again, everybody. Sorry for the delay. Things have been interfering with filming some of these videos, but we're back again. Today, we're going to check out a little hidden portion of the side of Lookout Mountain. There used to be a wonderful little picnic area on the side of Lookout. Uh, due to budget constraints, it has been closed. So, we're going to go and take a look. So, let's go have some fun today. Well, this is the beginning of the road. Used to be that you would come off of Sanders Road, which is down there, and you do a little one-way little loop up here. There are some shelters up here, and there are some picnic areas in the woods. It's, it's actually quite a beautiful place, and I hate that it's been closed for a long time, but let's go take a look, shall we? And here's the beginning of some of the picnic area. You can see that right off the road are some nice picnic benches. Well, you can't really see it that good, but this looks like one of those little cables going across the road. I think this was to count cars, but I'm not really sure. Anybody else know? You've got what looks like a metal lock box and a black cable going across the road. And here we are up in one of the main areas. You cannot really see, but there are a lot of little picnic tables all around the area. And you've got the bathrooms. Now, just to give you a little spatial thing, those houses and condos and whatnot up there are the bottom part of a little area called Winter View that's on the side of the mountain. So that kind of gives you a reference as to where we are. All of the picnic benches appear to be made out of concrete. Probably a smart idea up here. And here we've got something left over. An old water fountain, I'm guessing. Now, to be honest, this may be open sometime, but considering that I come by here all the time and I have never seen the gate open, I think it has been closed. This is part of that old school part of the park service where they actually made beautiful comfort stations and where things were a lot more solid. Something tells me this building will be here for a long time. You've got the men and you've got the women. Nothing fancy, but it'll do. There's stuff on the ground, so 
birdies and creatures have made it in here. You got the good old institutional block. Nope, no water. You can see the wall is the uh, property line. And again, there's little trails and little picnic things all over the place. It's interesting what nature will do. A lot of water comes running down through here. And because nobody's cleaned the leaves in a long time, the water has carved itself a nice little thing down that way. Well, surprising that that is still holding up, but it held up very well to a tree falling on it. And even more picnic areas. I think they were anticipating a whole bunch of people being up here. You are here. Here we have a lonesome picnic table out by itself. And others. And then I can only think that these were removed from wherever they were and parked here. And here we have another of the comfort stations. This one looks like it's in a little bit worse shape. But look, it's a slate roof. some garbage can. Well, this one still has a water fountain. Dare we try? Nope. No water. Laid out virtually the same way as the others. This one has some wooden panels of some kind. Not 100% sure where these would be in this area. Now this one is a little bit worse for the wear. More windows broken out. And it looks like the roof is coming down. But don't forget to wash your hands. Just in case you didn't know whose padlock this was. Another water fountain in the woods. And some stairs leading to them. I 
And another dense patch of the tables are down here. All overlooking Sanders Road. And oh look, another building. And more water fountains. And there is where the one way comes back out. This restroom is closed. There's full bottles of Rejuve. Maybe from 97? So at least the bottles are from 1997. We have cups. We have jugs of some kind. And then just to make things a little weird, two boxes of clay pigeons. And yes, they appear to be fairly full. Don't know if somebody was anticipating to do some shotgunning in here or just hiding stuff. Another lonesome garbage can. Although to be perfectly honest folks, if you do come up here and visit, just pack out your own garbage. Try to leave it like you found it, or better. It doesn't hurt that much to see this kind of beautiful place, even though it's kind of abandoned, to still stay pretty. Well guys, thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this little trip to the side of Lookout Mountain. I'll be doing journeys again, but until the journeys that I make, Go and make some journeys of your own. See you guys next time.